and you'll see this wonderful, wonderful page. Before we click this, let's show you the applications that you get with this. And you can use any USB drive uh, for this. Uh, a thumb drive is a thumb drive is is obviously really, really great because it's smaller than your iPod. But if you have your iPod connected, this is a great alternative. You get you know Firefox, Thunderbird as your email client. You get all of this stuff. You get portable Audacity. You get a media player. You get Open Office. All of this great stuff here. Now let's go back and click this little picture here, and it says download now in the top corner. You have an 89.5 gigabyte standard version, which includes everything, and you have the light version. And you have the base edition here. Now, I, I don't want everything. I'm selective, so I, I download the base edition because it has nothing, nothing, nothing on there. No program, absolutely nothing. You just hit the menu. So it'll take you to SwitchForge.net. I already have it downloaded, so no need for that. All right. So I suggest downloading it to your desktop. All right. So what you do is you go to your desktop, open up your drive, and you take it and drag it. Let's pretend like this iTunes is that. Take it and drag it into your drive, open it, and installing it. Okay. So you take it, open it, install it. Uh and what you want to do is install it on uh what can I say? Install it. See, normally on Windows computers, here go iTunes again, I just double clicked it. Normally on Windows computers, uh you have your programs are tied to something called the uh registry. And so you can't take it to another computer because it might not work. But with this, it installs all on there. All right. So then you come here, click this little thing here. But first, what you have to do is go to your hard drive, uh, your iPod, and click the Star Portable Apps button. It'll be right there and it'll look just like that. But I already have it opened up. So we'll click it. Oh, well, it's not open now because I just closed it. Let's do that then. Click it double click and it'll open alright so when you get it it'll have nothing over here because I recommend you download the base because then you have to go uninstall and I'll show you how to uninstall in just a second uh, so here's how you install so here's how you install it you go back to portableapps.com click on applications find the application I suggest you first start out with a web browser and here you'll see it right here, Mozilla Firefox Portable Edition. All the add-ons and extensions and themes work for this. And so you just download it, and I, I say download it to your desktop. Alright? And then you come back into the Portable Apps menu, go to Options, Install a New App. Click Install. Find it on your desktop somewhere and install it. Simple, easy. Then it'll say reinstall, Restart It. When you restart it, your new app is there. And deleting an app is just as easy. And I don't want to X this out to show you how to delete it. But all you do is go to your portable drive. You open up the portable apps folder. And whichever app is named right here, you just click it, press delete on your keyboard, or delete this folder. And then you restart your portable apps menu and your portable app is gone so it's just that easy so I suggest you start uh, you know using portable apps you got an iPod you got a thumb drive you know use it you know but let me tell you something if you got a small uh, 32 megabyte drive uh, when you install Firefox and the portable apps menu you're not gonna have any room to say bookmarks so I suggest at least a one gig. I have a two gig uh, hard drive for this, but I suggest at least a one gigabyte um, hard drive. These for this, so you can save your bookmarks, you can save your favorites, you can use extensions, you can use add-ons, you can save your email. You know, because this you're taking this anywhere, just plug it in and just run it. It's just that simple. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of Insider Secrets. We'll see you next time. Have a wonderful day, and remember. 
take your applications anywhere. Nothing is too hard for you. All it is is a mindset thing. So change your mind and do anything. Enjoy your day.